balance sheet of uh, a company here i am uh, making a uh, performa of balance sheet with imaginary figures and in this uh, tutorial i will explain uh, each items fixed assets uh, means uh, those assets which we uh, purchased uh, for long time and in these assets uh, we will uh, include land building furniture fixture vehicles and equipments and uh, for this uh, we have to calculate uh, net value suppose uh, this is uh, total asset is 12 lakh but fixed asset asset is 5 lakh this amount will be calculated after deducting depreciation deducting depreciation depreciation after this we will take investment investment means uh, any amount which uh, a company invests in other companies and other projects for earning in the form of dividend or interest we should know what is the amount of uh, investment and uh, after this we should know what is the amount of current assets in current assets we sh uh, should add debtors current as uh, cash bank and uh, outstanding incomes advance expenditures now we will discuss one more item that is called miscellaneous expenditures this is uh, uh, also called miscellaneous assets there is nothing in this example but uh, uh, these miscellaneous expenditures uh, means any uh, expenditure which is not uh, written off uh, by transferring to the profit and loss account so these uh, expenditure or asset will also show in uh, the asset side there is not a market value of uh, these assets but uh, uh, these uh, expenditures uh, have very large amount so we will uh, transfer to uh, it to uh, profit and loss in uh, uh, in a very small small parts after this uh, 
we will uh, tell you about share capital actually share capital uh, means uh, equity share capital and profit share capital which we have to uh, return separately and for calculating a net amount of share capital we uh, will apply simple formula what is the amount of called up capital minus uh, unpaid value of share capital and less uh, this amount will be uh, less from called up capital and uh, after this we add the amount uh, which we received from share forfeited and this net amount will be shown as a share capital 